Introducing the Watts ACV M115F. You'll see that it has grooved end connections. It's also available with threaded ends, 150 pound flanges, and 300 pound flanges. The purpose of this valve is to accept a varying inlet pressure and maintain a constant lower downstream pressure. The valve cover and the diaphragm create a control chamber. Flow of water into and out of the control chamber causes the main valve to open and close. Inside is a diaphragm disc assembly that moves up and down inside of the valve to open and close it to control the flow through the seat area. The valve operates under the control of the CP15 pressure reducing pilot, which is very dependable and has proven very effective over time. Here's how it operates. The inlet pressure enters the control tubing and flows through a restriction fitting that is identified by the red dye. The water can go either into or out of the cover, modulating the main valve, or it can exit the pilot system through the CP15 pressure reducing pilot. The CP15 pilot reacts to the downstream water pressure to allow the valve to maintain a constant downstream pressure. These pressure reducing valves are UL listed as an assembly. They are available with various end connections and in both globe and angle body styles. You can download literature on Watts pressure reducing valves at watts.com.